But what I witnessed last night went to the heart of who we are as Americans. It went to the heart of what we value um, as citizens as we talk about uh, this, this grand experiment we call America and the rights that we enjoy under our Constitution and what that means to then in that moment have a candidate for the highest office of the land basically say to us, uh, not me as a Republican, not anyone as a Democrat or independent, but to all of us as Americans, that if I lose this, I may not give up the fight. If I lose this, my minions, my people may have something else to say. And that to me just, to put it bluntly, pissed me off because it really went to, as I said, the heart of who we are and what it means to be an American citizen as an example to the rest of the world of what democracy and freedom uh, and the electoral process is about. We go around the world teaching and telling people how to conduct free and open elections and why it is so important to have an easy, smooth transition, if you will, of power. So that for me was a very disturbing moment and uh, I tweeted out it when he said that. I said, this, this is disqualifying, it is disturbing, and at the end of the day, um, Americans want to know that you can be a good loser when it's all said and done. I mean, you all, we all get the battles, right? We know what the politics is like, but when it's all said and done, can you be a good loser? Uh, and it's very clear he could not.